everyone today i am doing another unpackaging so today we have a ton and ton and tons of albums we have twice's eyes wide open super m super one uh red velvet zinzella beam or Re red velvet festival part one we have a girl's generation album a b2b album a wavy i don't know what it's called like a lookbook or a photo book or like one of those really big books i don't know i have black pink again however i'm not gonna be opening these because they are for my friend so i bought these i actually bought these in person because all my other ones are bought on k town for you as i usually do but these ones i bought at what is the store called sunrise records which is i think it's also in the u.s but it's a cd slash vinyl store in canada and they do have a k-pop section now so there was like bts there's super m however super m was super expensive it's like 70 bucks um there's blackpink and there's nct so i got some nct albums for my one friend for christmas and then these are the other ones i'm giving to my friend for his birthday so he's gonna see these soon but i'm not gonna open them i'm just gonna give it to him in person albums are like 35 to 45 dollars unless you're super empty you're freaking 70 dollars however when i buy from k-town for you other than the shipping because shipping is a whole nother issue but albums are like a good 10 to 15 bucks so usd not canadian this was all in canadian this is like 15 to 20 bucks canadian and then i also have some magazines today so it's gonna be one of my bigger unboxings and i'm gonna take a while but we're gonna have some fun with it today because i have assignments due because it's this is my third last week or second last week something like that i don't even know what is happening with my schedule but yeah i'm almost done my first semester of second year and i'm doing this instead so <laughs> should we just start so i have these black pink photo cards or like traffic cards is what they uh advertise them as so this is this is lisa and then we also have Rosé. Okay, that's all for Blackpink. We're gonna start off with our girl groups and then we're gonna move into our boy groups and then we're gonna move on to the magazines. Let's do the oldest one. So we're gonna open Girls Gen. Ah, okay. Okay, SNSD. This is their last latest. I hope it's not their last album, but their latest album as an eight member group because i think was it three or four members actually left sm but they said they would still remain as a group and i'm just like will they really <laughs> in this economy will they really the title tracks all night oh that's a holiday is the album called holiday night <gasps> the album's called holiday that's why it's a holiday night back. here's the thing i forget like majority of the members like i don't know a good like five of them <laughs> i don't remember their names so hopefully this doesn't go too bad <laughs> here is the booklets they be thriving at are they 30 are they are they 30 or are they almost 30 i think they're 30 maybe <gasps> tiffany miss thing this thing is thriving though in the western music industry though but yeah i don't remember their name so i was gonna say their names but my head is blinking oh okay didn't break yet but i'm scared i'm going to Oh, there's my baby Yuna. I love Yuna so much. I love Yuna so much that I got one of her magazines. So that is the photo book. Not much to show. Not much to show. I shouldn't be saying that. There's a lot of show, but I don't have the time or patience. Here's the SM Trash. And oh my gosh, Hyohyun. Hyohyun, is that how you pronounce her name? Once again, not a Korean. So I can't pronounce anything in Korean. But she's so pretty. And then that's the back of her little card. I don't know she's been thriving too i've seen her on i think some like competition shows some korean competition shows and there's a cd on the back honestly it's such a cute album but why is it not is why is this not magnetized that is my issue of all these damn albums like if you're gonna do this please magnetize that so it doesn't fall back open does that not make any sense do you do y'all not comprehend that well sm doesn't because sm just recently called back so i bought recently nct 2020s part two and they called it back because uh something was wrong with their printing this is part one all over again part one they didn't print enough and then i was waiting for like a month for it to come in and now i'm waiting for part two to be released because part two isn't out and i just saw hawking and me being a canadian and a really big hawk fan i'm like oh my goodness i better see like 18 photo shoots of everyone in those damn hockey uniforms yeah that is it for uh snsd's holiday night we are going to move on 
to their sister group or sister sister group because technically next would be fx and then after that it's red velvet and then there's espa is that espa i hope that's how you pronounce it but beats me i don't know i'm literally depressed that red velvet only got one actually did they even have a comeback in here they only had um the subunit come out which was irene and Solgi, but Ever since Psycho, they haven't promoted, which makes sense because um, Miss Wendy is. Can I not even open this? Hello? Miss Wendy is injured. <laughs> well, I don't know if she's still injured or not because they have been doing performances, but she hasn't been dancing. Hopefully, they get a comeback soon, but it's all up to Wendy and all that. I should have really brought scissors. And for this one, I also got Irene. And here's the thing I love Irene. Like, Irene is my. um, She is my uh, bias in Red Velvet, but she had a little. Scandal on the side, a little attitude issue on the side. And I want to give her the benefit of the doubt because I know everyone has bad days and everyone everyone has some sort of attitude. I mean, I have a big attitude issue. <laughs> My manager knows that. <laughs> but I don't know. It's like kind of a hit or miss situation for me. I'm gonna give her the benefit of the doubt. I'm not gonna say that she's completely innocent because you should try to treat everyone nicely as possible. But sometimes, you know what? Well, you're just not having one of those days. And I completely get it. But anyways, enough of that talk. Also, I look like trash. Can we just talk about how bad I look right now? I look fried. I look tired because I am. And my hair is not cooperating with me. And I'm wearing a comfortable sweater because it's our snow or another day. Right? Like straight up, like 10 centimeters of snow. Now that doesn't sound a lot, but just out of nowhere, it was like sunny. It was like 14 degrees. And then the next day it drops down and starts freaking snowing everywhere. That is Canadian weather for you. Um, here it is. Revel Festival Part 1 with Zinzilla Bean. Can they not just like put a magnet on? Because my life would be so much happier. So much happier if they only had a damn magnet. Anyways, I'm not ranting about that. I think this is all entire, 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 entire Irene package. CD on the back. Very similar setup to um, SNSZ's album. SM Trash. Honestly, at this rate, I'm just like, SM, what are you doing? What are you doing? <gasps> and we have Wendy. Ah, uh, she looks so good. She looks so good. But can we just talk about how the stylist did her dirty? I talked about this last time when I opened up part one. But the stylist did her so damn dirty. Like, what was that damn? Was it, was it green? It was like green. And she looked like one of those things that spin when you go through like a car wash. Like they spin and they like clean your car when you go through a car wash. And she looked like one of those. I don't know what the stylist was thinking. I don't know what anyone was thinking. I don't know who approved it. But yeah, she looks so much better here. What a queen. We got all of us lying on each other. Because that's not weird. <laughs> it was a weird era. Oh, this, this is... Okay, so it's not a dress. It's a top. I'm so sorry. But does she not look like one of those things that you... That clean your car when you go through like a car wash? I'm just saying. It looks identical to one. Who's that? Is that Yuri? <gasps> wow. Sis popped up. Sis is a whole two years older than me and she looks like that. She looks like this. Someone get me a stylist. Someone get someone teach me how to do makeup because I don't know how to do makeup. Oh, and there's Miss Joy and Selgi. Joy's proportions. Top tier. A pure blessing. Not even for her. It's a pure blessing for me to look at her and I'm just like, holy shit. <laughs> So there's that. And then there comes a little package here. I believe it's going to be all Irene. What the hell? Are we doing some arts and crafts shit now? Okay. I guess this is a balloon. And then I think these are glasses. <laughs> I swear this was not in the package last time. Last time I opened. Oh, yeah. These are sunglasses. Oh, that's nice. That's, that's real nice. Well, um... Seems like we have some. Oh, what's this? Oh, and there's Miss. Oh, so are we imitating Miss Irene here? Because she has the exact same glasses as, a, as we were given. Fun and fresh. And we got a get a balloon. I don't know what to what a, what to say about that. That sounds on definitely on some sort of like other kind of drug. Cause I don't know what's happening. I don't think anyone knows what's happening there. I don't know what's happening there. I doubt the artists know what's happening there. They're probably just like, these people need help. They need to be admitted to a psychi psychiatric ward. And that's on period. Also, I don't think I have ever shown anyone this. 
Like, here's my phone. Here's the phone cord. Isn't that so much fun? Don't we just love that? <laughs> oh, yeah, it's really weird when my coworkers plug in my phone or I ask someone to plug in my phone and that starts playing. It's a little awkward, it's a little hard to explain, but you know what? At the end of the day, they're just like, yeah, it's just Cindy. She does whatever she wants. Anyways, moving on to Eyes Wide Open. My friend and I bought all three versions. So we have three, I think these are the special group cards. So they're all the same. <laughs> There's three of them, so each one for each album. And on top of that, we have three, I think these are pre-order cards. And so there's one for each set. I think it goes these two. So this is the style version, which, oh, them in suits. Top tier shit. This is the retro version, which is my favorite. I, oh, sisters. And then the last version is the story version, which is the black one. Usually I would love the all black version, but we're trying another style today. We shall start opening up, starting with the style version. So here are the photo cards. Well, the pre-order photo cards. If y'all know me, y'all know that I don't remember these members very well. The amount of times I've opened these albums and I still can't distinguish each member is kind of embarrassing on my part. So we're trying to get through this today. And they have no names in the back. Thank you very much, JYP. Nah. <laughs> Did I already get it wrong? It says Nayan. Nayan? Jungyan? Momo? Who? <laughs> this is Sana? Jihyo? What is her name? Mina? Daehyun? Chaeyoung? Okay, can we just talk about quickly how Chaeyoung has like this tattoo boyfriend that we didn't know about, but she has a bunch of tattoos, and I'm just like, that is some queen shit right there. Getting a boyfriend who does your tattoos for you, I wish. And then we have Tui. Damn, I didn't realize there were this many songs in the album. I swear I've listened to like majority of these songs and I didn't realize that there were that many. Here's the album Eyes Wide Open, style version. Oh my, oh dear lord. I always forget. Why is this, why does this always like fly past my head every time I open a Twice album? But they have so many things in these damn albums. Like already a sticker set, but we love some sticker sets because we love designing everything with stickers. I used to hate stickers, but now as an adult, I'm just like, stickers are top tier. Now, top tier is going to be my favorite word, apparently, because uh, I've said it too many times already, and it's barely been half the video. Stickers. Here's the lyric book with <gasps> Jihyo. Cute. But the lyric book. I can't believe she broke up with Daniel. Or, well, I don't know if that's a good thing. I don't know if it's a bad thing, but I just can't believe. And then we have Miss Jonghyun as the CD. And where is the individual photo card? We have Tui. <laughs> and is this a special card? It's in an envelope. We have Nayan. A hello. Why does it look like a magazine cover? And then a little message on the back. But it's in Korean. Can't read it to ya. So have fun deciphering that one. Plus a group card. So it has Daihyun, Momo, Sana, and Nayan. Another photo card. And we have. Oh, is that Momo and her dog? <laughs> Absolutely iconic. And then here's the back. We also have Young. Hello. That green eyeshadow is so nice on her. And lastly, for this album, what is your name? Mina. Ooh. Is that, is that a wig? That is a wig, right? <laughs> like, I'm not just like blind and didn't realize that she just had like a long blonde bob with bangs. Regardless, we're like, <gasps> sister. Wait, what's that mean? Where's that Jonghyun? Am I stupid? Oh, that's Jonghyun. Anyways, we're gonna pretend we didn't hear that. Here's Miss Mina. I think she's not participating in this one. Is she? Is she not? <gasps> Hello. Hello, Miss Momo. <laughs> I literally, I can't. I cannot. Oh, that is some um, female empowerment right now. I can't stop me. They can't stop themselves because they are too good. That's why they can't stop themselves. So that is the style version of Twice. We're gonna be moving on to the is this the retro version. The retro version of Eyes Wide Open. I really, really love this concept. I don't know why. I think it just reminds me of 
is it Signal? And Signal was a jam. Did it win song of the year? I'm pretty sure. It was either Signal or Knocked Off that won song of the year. Why can I not open these albums today? I'm really struggling. What am I doing? I did the cards first last time. Might as well do the cards again. So here we go. Once again, in order. Nayeon. Ah, uh, Jungyeon. Momo. Sana. <laughs> Jihyo. Mina. Daehyun. Chaeyoung. And then Tui plus a group card. Did I miss a group card in that last one? Wait. <gasps> I missed a group card. Anyways, the styles are very different. This is very much cutesy. Or not cutesy, but cuter. And the other one is very serious, sleek, boss ass bitch kind of, uh, kind of mood, you know? Here we go. Once again, same sticker set. The exact same sticker set. Plus Daehyun on the lyric book, lyric sheet. And for my CD, I have Jihyo. We're flipping straight to Miss Mina. Who else is there? <gasps> Jihyo. Jihyo looks so good in dyed hair. Miss Chaeyoung. Sana. <laughs> I don't think it's too easy, so hopefully it's Sana. I don't know why I get those two mixed up. Like genuinely, I don't know why, but I miss Momo because everyone can recognize Momo. Um, those are song photos. <laughs> My way of unboxing is like three bottles and that's it. I got Momo for my special card or special, I don't know, envelope card or whatever. But And then the message is so in Korean. We have Chaeyoung. We have an entire group card. That's cute. Momo. Hello? Does she not have long hair? I swear she has long hair in this comeback. This is a wig. This is... Tui. And then we have Sauna. A Sauna and a Tui back to back. I am surprised that did not fuck me up. If this was a while ago, I would have been like, this is the same person. They look so young. They are so young. They are so really young though. And that will be all for the retro version. Now moving on to the last version, which is the story version. And this one kind of gives me the creeps. <laughs> They're all wearing black. It reminds me of a funeral home. Starting with the pre-order photo cards. <gasps> okay, they look so good in these ones too. Hello? Nayeon. Jihyo. Oh my god, I don't know why I just said Jihyo. Jungyeon. <laughs> the clownery. Momo. Sana. Jihyo. Mina. Daehyun. Chaeyoung. Tui. And then the group photo card. Oh. Oh wow. This one is very sultry. We said sexy. They really uh, just pulled up three different concepts. <laughs> that makes a lot of sense as to why they would have so many dance sets in the music video. I swear that music video gave me whiplash because every two seconds it would change to a new set and I did not know what was going on. Once again, the exact same photo sets. With the lyric sheet, we have Tui. <laughs> Tui. And then on the CD, we have Tui, again, because it says Tui, so I can confirm this one. And she has this exact same color hair, so I'm guessing it's Tui. And Lasana also has this hair color. They really said, we are at a funeral home. <laughs> I wish they were red for this this uh, concept, this photo shoot and stuff like that. But you know what? The black is good. Black is nice too. Oh, I hate looking at feet. Feet just make me like uncomfortable. I don't care whose feet. I don't care what it is, feet just make me uncomfortable. Okay, we got Miss Jihyo, Miss Chaeyoung, Nayeon, Momo. Oh, I haven't been showing the back. Shoot. And Miss Daehyun. This is so cute. Oh my goodness. And then in the special card, we have Nayeon. Oh, oh. And that is really all for eyes wide open three very different styles oh hello mina oh my god top tier shit we said queen shit only now that we are done with our girl groups we are gonna move on to the boy groups so i have a super m album and i have a b to b album so why don't we start with the b to b this is much older this is their album this is us and i think this was their was their yeah their last comeback at seven because they had a comeback as six members and then they recently had a subunit debut with four members. And that had Pinil, Unkwang, 
chum sub and mini hyuk and oh that one i've ordered two versions of because that whole album is so good wow she's a whole biggie it's a little glossy on the little front i love that it's a slip which i <sighs> what who are they under cube oh okay now this makes sense why is there slip oh okay <laughs> Sub again, and then we got the CD with all of them vibing. Is this the song where they were vibing on the boat? I feel like that's a different song, or um, is this even Beautiful Pain? I feel like this wasn't Beautiful Pain. I am very confused. <laughs> I don't know. I know that one title track they were like vibing on a boat or a yacht or like whatever it was, and they kind of look like they're having that vibe. But Beautiful Pain is like a sad song, so this might not be for Beautiful Pain. Confusion, yes. In addition to that, we have the photo book. Oh, <laughs> I love just snapping things open, you know? We got a postcard, don't they look so cute? And, oh, it's a pink ticket? That's what it says on the back. Don't know what this is for. I'm sure it's for something. Will I use it? Probably not, because it's all in Korean and I can't read that. We also have <gasps> Min Hyuk as a bookmark. He's so cute. His bangs were super short in here. I don't know how to feel about the super short bangs. What is this? Cube Entertainment. Audition? No, 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 no. After what they did to Miss Kina and E Don, or well now Don, no, no. What a trash ass company. <gasps> oh my god, we got Peniel? What a king, holy shit. <laughs> he really do be vibing though. That's his center in the back. His hair is dyed pink currently, and I'm just like, yes, yes. That is some superior styling. Oh, I forgot how good their photo shoots are. Sungjae, oh, make me cry. <sighs> ah, can you stop looking like that? Can you stop? Like, genuinely, I'm like about to cry. I'm trying to find my baby Ilhan. There's Camille. Big baby. He's like massive. Like, genuinely, like massive in body size. But. Sorry, my stomach. But he's like the softest one out of all of them. The rest of them are just chaotic. Where's Ilhan's photo shoot? I'm so sorry that y'all just hear my stomach gurgling. Did not have breakfast yet. That's a bad decision on my part. <laughs> Hello. <gasps> oh, yes, man's bread. Yes, man's bread. Man's bread. <laughs> I can't wait for the rest of the group to come back from the military because I just can't wait for them to be all me together again. I miss them. I miss them as one group. Their crackheadedness, their weirdness. They literally are so weird. Now moving on to Super One from Super M. I have bought a Super One album from, I think, SM's Global Shop. However, because I bought it with a signed poster from Big Ken, it's taking 14 freaking million years to come here because apparently it was in pre-order and it's actually being shipped out end of November, which is soon, and then I'll get it in December. But I'm really glad that K-Town sent me the whole group because I bought specifically, I think it was like Baekhyun and two other, two other members? I don't know who they were. It's one of the ones where you lift, oh, where you lift up. Thank you. I don't know what this is all is. This is, uh, they said we're going to make your life difficult. Oh, <laughs> what is this? Similarly to Red Velvets, there's like a little package. And then we also have the actual photo book this is like one of my favorite albums this year all the songs except for 100 which i cannot listen to 100 or better days i literally don't have better days on my phone because once i start speak rapping i just like want to dig a hole and die in that hole because i cannot listen to people speak rap it's not my thing <gasps> taehyung oh a whole a snack wish you were here it was so good oh there's taemin too there's mr taemin oh my god my baby bacon Y'all probably think my bias is Baekhyun, but he's actually my bias director. My bias is Kyungsu. And that actually takes a lot of people by surprise because I have so much Baekhyun stuff only because like Kyungsu's been in the military for the past like year and a half. So uh, I kind of had to stock up on Baekhyun stuff while he was promoting. But when Kyungsu comes along, oh, Baekhyun who? Baekhyun who? <laughs> I only know Kyungsu. I only know the love of my life. <laughs> we got Mark here, Mark Lee, Lucas. Wow. Sorry, my hand's like actually covering the entire freaking thing. <gasps> is that 
Jongin. Can they like give him a shirt like every now and then? Like I get it, like he has an amazing body and it sells very well. But like, you know, every other photo shoot doesn't need um, a shirtless pic, right? Cause they have, you know, shirts exist, coats exist, things exist. Also, I'm so sorry, I've been like here the entire time. <laughs> I'm like off centered. That probably bothered like y'all and me. It's gonna bother me when I start editing this. Oh, 10. A dancing god. Wait, why is Bacon's hair white? Wait, why is he. Why? Why is he wearing a sheer shirt? Why is he wearing a sheer shirt? Nipples? Like, <laughs> seeing nipples and sheer shirts, I'm just like, I don't know if I like that or if I, it's like very uncomfortable. I really don't know. Oh, finally, he's wearing some shirts. Oh, so uh, Bacon and Jong Yun uh, switched for a little bit. They just went, oh, you're shirtless now, so I'm gonna be shirtless now. <gasps> Ted Young. Oh my gosh. Ooh, Ten and Tanman. What an amazing pair. Mark again. This is like one of the only like albums I'm showing the entire photo shoot, but like I just can't get over them, bro. And we got Lucas as well. Bright ass green. They said we're gonna pull a neo zone on on y'all right now. Oh, is this SM trash again? Ooh, we love a good soccer postcard. Okay. Who do we have as a poster? Who is this? Is this Baekhyun? I see this. Oh my god, it's Baekhyun! Oh my god, sir, can I make? I have so many Baekhyun, Baekhyun posters, I don't know what to do with them all. Should I just like make a room and just stick up all his posters on there? Just on one wall? That's a little creepy, a little weird. We got the CD in here. This is like very unsafe. And I can't even open it. <gasps> Very unsafe. We still just got some photos, some nice photos of them. Why does it look like, why is he taking it off his coat like that? Anyways, we also got, is this a group poster? Oh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, we said black and white with green accents. Full force, aim high. We go 100. <laughs> no, no, okay, 100 is not it. 100, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, but 100 is not it, bro. Sorry, I'm like scrolling through these, scrolling, flipping through these real fast. But, oh, tiger inside, we said. <gasps> we have 10. <gasps> 10. Ooh, he looks so cute. He's adorable. <gasps> and then we have 10 in Jongin. <laughs> this is like some top tier postcard, photo card shit. Oh my god. The gods are bringing me 10. The god, the gods knew. The gods knew. They were just like, she needs some 10 in her life. They knew. That is all for the albums. Now moving on. I believe it's called Issue? Issue Korea? We have Miss Yuna. As I mentioned before with my SMUSD album, Yuna is my absolute favorite. She is adorable. Her acting, not top tier, but it's very good. Honestly, I watch her dramas or like movies just for her like she just makes me want to cry oh so effortless oh uh, and she also has this interview but once again in korean can't read korean so that's a little issue right there but that was one of the posts magazines that i got the other magazine we got here has miss rose okay this is some queen shit like holy crap <gasps> But oh my gosh, she looks so freaking good. Like, holy mother of the lord. I don't understand how someone could look this amazing. I'm pretty sure Chung Yul is in here as well. Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, it like comes as a, like its own separate thing. I thought it was gonna be like in, in the magazine, but it's like this one little separate thing. We got like this little mini Chung Yul one. And he's advertising Prada because he, I think he's sponsored or he has a partnership with. Prada and oh, oh, okay, King. Okay, King. Anyways, the last magazine that we got here is Jongin's magazine. Now, I think I have another one of his magazines coming and his mini albums coming along because I think he has three versions and then like a flip book. So there's four of his mini album coming. He is looking like a whole like donut, like a glazed donut, like a honey glazed donut. So soft, so gorgeous, so smooth. Oh, bro. Oh. Oh. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I'm like starstruck. How do you look like this? 
and just like walk around knowing that you look like them? That's a genuine question. Is there any more? <gasps> wow. Wow. King shit. Straight up king shit. So the last thing that we are opening today is this wavy photo book. Um, it's massive. Like, it's gigantic. This When I got this, I originally was just like, who sent me a whole ass, like, dictionary? Because that is how big it looks. It is thick. It is tall. It is wide. Like, for what reason? It's, I think, a photo book. So, like, who needs a photo book this size? Like, genuinely, even my exo photo books that they release like almost every year are not this big and it's made out of cardboard <laughs> this is unusual usually it's made out of like paper but it's like a whole cardboard situation and like was it take off the moon it has that stupid little like um flap that goes into the book which is so annoying because you can never open it properly so it opens up like that and there's like 14 million things inside so we got a crap ton of things in here what is this Oh my god, this is like overwhelming. I thought this was gonna be just like an easy like opening like just flip through a book and look through photos. Ooh, that photo card. What? Uh, what? <laughs> he looks like a damn angel. Bro. And then we also have a Polaroid, which it looks the exact same, but oh my god. Like this is some god tier shit. And then we have a photo of him. Oh wow. We got another photo of him? This is this unpackaging is gonna be as long as like all the other albums combined. He generally looks so adorable. And then we have this little message. He says hi 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 and then it says everything in Mandarin. I think it's Mandarin. Is that Mandarin? And then he has like a heart and has like how many people are in there? Are there seven people in there for the wavy members? Oh this is all a wavy. Oh my god. I thought they just like copied and pasted um Henry and it was just like like uh photoshopped him side by side. But no, it's wavy. It's all the wavy. And then we have another photo of him. Wow, wow, wow. And finally, the last photo of him. But he looks freaking adorable. Like, holy. Okay, so what is that package? Oh my good lord. <laughs> here we have some stickers. And there's some other members in here. And then there's just like the wavy members at the bottom. Adorable. This is so cute. Oh, and on the back, I didn't even notice. There's Kun, um, Yang Yang, and Lucas. Oh, so we have all the members on here on the sticker side. That's adorable. Moving on to whatever the frick this is. This is massive. Are these photos of all the members? Because there's 10. And then we move it on to 10. And then we have Win Win, Lucas, Xiao Jun. <laughs> God damn, I'm blind. Henry, and Yang Yang. Oh, and a group photo. That's This is so cute. What the heck? Oh, and another group photo. And then we're back. And now, lastly, reaching the entire photo book. This is very, like, pleasant to look at because it's white with blue accents. Bro, you can never go wrong with white and blue accents. These are all these, like, separate packages. Like, is there a need to, like, package all these up? Here she is. She is a, a massive one. Okay. Okay. They said we're gonna have an amazing photo shoot. A whole ass... Beautiful, gorgeous. Ah. <laughs> he looks, what the heck? I'm just, I'm in awe. Oh, okay. Okay, win win. Okay, win win. <laughs> you can look like that, but not under not under my watch. I'm gonna flip to a different page then. Um, you can't even see. Is that Lucas? Yes. I hope that's Lucas, or else I'm gonna be clowning myself because Lucas is literally one of the most distinguishable members. Oh, they look so good. Who who allowed them? Who? Uh, I'm choking. Oh, what the heck? Why does it look like that? Why does it look like it? Why? 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 So that is um the end, which is uh 14 million freaking things. But that is gonna be all for today because I have opened up every single magazine, this photo book, and every single album. But hopefully you guys will still be interested in this because this is going to be released like almost two months after I filmed it. So I hope you enjoyed. There are going to be more album unboxings coming up soon or whatever. We'll see. We'll genuinely see. But thank you for watching everyone and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!